And then, Coach, does that mean you are open to bringing experienced players into this Bafana side, or will you continue to look to replace these players with young players, uh, inexperienced players? You know, I'm looking for quality. And, and if I have a young player with quality for a position, and an older player with quality for a position, I take the young player. Mm. But if I don't have a young player with quality, I take an older player. And it's for sure. For me, quality is the first thing I look at. And so, then, okay, if I have to choose between a young one and an older one with the same quality, I will always take the young Let's talk very quickly, Coach, about Ethiopia. We've struggled against Ethiopia in the past. Um, you know, October is not far away. And everybody's saying it's guaranteed must get six points, coach. It seems like a lot of pressure. <laughs> yes, but how, how can you tell now that it's guaranteed six points? And, and two weeks or four weeks ago, everyone was doubting that we should win against Zimbabwe or Ghana. Mm. So this is, this is not the way it goes. It's not because we have won against Ghana, but now you, you, you will win easily against Ethiopia two times. No, but there are two crucial games. If, if we can win two times, we have a big chance, we have a big chance to go through. But we are first in our group if we win those two games. Mm. There is a big chance, so they are very crucial. And we have prepared them very good. And uh, when we were in camp, we will prepare the players that they are ready, they are ready for those two games. But for this games, you had an expectation. You said four points was your basic goal, your minimum for these two games. What's the goal against Ethiopia? The goal is to win two times. This is for sure. Again, if we want to, to, um, if we want to have a chance to be first in our group, we have to win those two games. Mm. To be a little bit sure. Not sure, but a little bit. But if we lose points, then we will be in struggle again and in, in, in fight again with maybe even Zimbabwe and, and Ghana or, or Ghana and, and, and Ethiopia or, or what else. You will be in the fight with two, three other, or two, certainly two teams and maybe three teams to be first. So if we can avoid that, we have to do it. And if we win two times against Ethiopia, there will be already maybe two uh, uh, countries who will be out of it. And it will be between us and another uh, country. And that's the situation I like to have after the games of, uh, of uh, Ethiopia. You know, Coach, the one thing that's happening right now is that South Africa is starting to believe that we can make it to the top of this group and we can be in the fight to go to Qatar 2022. Um you put yourself under pressure here, coach. No, it's not a question of pressure. It's a question of ambition. And if you don't have ambition in life, you will never achieve anything. And, and it doesn't mean either that you... It's not a guarantee that you will achieve it. But you need to have the ambition to have goals. Mm. And, and, and I have it, and I hope that my team has it also. Do they believe? Do you believe? Um, is it something that's in this squad, that qualification is a goal? Or is it still just an experiment of trying to put players together uh, and, you know, hope that it goes right? It has it is, it is, uh, never been an uh, experiment. It, has, it is a project. Mm. And this is a difference. So a project, you have a chance, a big chance that it, it, it succeeds. But an experiment, there you never know what will be the result. Mm. So uh, for us, this is a project, and we are working on it. And as I said already two months ago, when I came here in South Africa, we will, dis we will be disappointed. We are not qualified for World Cup. The dip is not a disaster. We are building something. And then after that, if we shouldn't be qualified for, uh, for World Cup, then the goal, the goal is to be qualified for Afghan. And this is something um, we, we have to do. There are no excuses anymore then. So South Africa has to qualify them for the African 23. But here now, okay, we are young, we are unexperienced, still unexperienced, the team, and we will see that we are on the, on the right way. And let's hope, let's hope that we can succeed to beat uh, um, Ethiopia two times. All right, coach. Thank you very much. All the best. Okay. Get your paperwork sorted out. Have a safe flight and 
you know, congratulations to yourself and the boys. You made South Africa okay. very, very happy. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much.